had this face with these two eyes, and then this this is a hole under here. There were three holes. And boy, I figured that would make one hell of a good looking face. My God, I fit like 10,000 miles on one trip. But see, it's art coming out in me in a different way. You understand what I mean? It's a different different type of art. Well, I, I, I load it myself. You must have a hell yeah, of a well, muscle. Man. Well, see, I got low blood pressure now. I can't do what I used to do. I get I, I'm an artist. See, that, that's what I got to kick up before that. I, I just made it out of junk, you know. The whole thing, everything you see out in the yard, in there, that dog that you see over toward the other door, yeah. cost less than $39.95 because I had the junk. Wow. See, I bought nothing. Right. I had to buy flashers when I started, started up and some spray paint. Mm -hmm. And uh, the rest of the stuff, I had it. screws and bolts and nuts and stuff like that. You, you did the wiring yourself? Oh, my, yeah, parts. oh my God, it looked like a, it, it would be a, what the hell would you say? It would be an electrician's nightmare. by making Jupiter when you made Sun. Because it's a completely different robot. You know, sure. the only thing you got the same is that they... <laughs> oh, his head don't go back and forth. So you don't, you didn't learn anything, you know what I'm trying to say. The only thing that <clears throat> I did learn, they're all like that. You have to have an angle clean down right into the plate underneath the shoe mm -hmm. to bolt that down. See, he'll stand up by himself. they stand out there unless it's blowing like a son of a gun. It makes you feel good, you know, when you... Did it, oh my God, under the worst conditions in the world. The worst you know. conditions? Well, I mean, the whole thing. I didn't have any tools to work with. I wouldn't buy anything too cheap for you to buy anything. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, that's what made it more worthwhile. Mm -hmm. You know, you did it w with nothing. S-U-N. Okay. Then, sun, that, that dog on the end, Pluto, that sun's dog down on the end there. It's hard to see with the reflection on the window, but anyway. Then the last addition to the family is, uh, oh, Sistar, the blue one here. So you have mother, father, brother, sister, dog. Now down at the museum there, you know, then that's that's where we had the Sistar married Mars. That's that red one down on the end there. And son, the yellow one, married Saturn. Uh -huh. So you had a double wedding of robot offspring. See, the nice thing about this, when I first had to marry in Elwood City, made USA Today, made AP Wire Service, no one, not even Disney, had a family of robots. Oh, no. Now, now you, got, you can go a step farther now. They, not only did they not have a family, but with a double wedding of offspring from the family. See, oh, so no. you, got, you got it way down the line. You got it pretty well tied up. <laughs> then when I decided to make Venus uh, and... I took them out a few places, you know, and so forth. And, and, and the more they were out, uh, the more people you know, enjoyed them. So it, it made me feel good too, and uh, it was good, good um, fuel for my ego, you know, and so forth. And I, uh, the more publicity I got on it, the more I liked it. And this I updated her skirt. I had a big piece of about that big of um, rubberized or plastic with steel. Uh, what would you call it, fins, I guess you call it, in there, holding the, holding this pipe apart. And my God, every time I turned around on the skirt, see, I had it folded, I had it turned out this way, you'd get jug, jagged on that darn edge of the skirt. Mm -hmm. Well, when I was down, I didn't care about me, but I didn't want it down at the museum. If they would brush it or something like that, right. you'd get, get, get right. jagged on your... So the thing, I just put this right over top of the whole thing, covered it up. And it made just as good a looking skirt, you know, as, oh, as the other. This to me was without the lenses. It was I could see a face there. It was going to be some kind of a face. Then uh -huh. you'd have to get some kind of eyes, see, to fit into it to make it look, you know, like a, like a face. But I would see these type of things long before I did any of the robots. I made him really for um, uh, for Pennsylvania's 300th birthday. Uh -huh. yeah, that was uh, I think uh, 80. See, he's a little older than the rest. He's uh. I made him winter 81, wait a minute, let me get this right now. 
Well, 81 was, was the 300th birthday. So I made him 80, winter of 80, into 80, in the beginning of 81. And his first appearance was down at Wampum at the uh, woman's club down there at Wampum. Uh -huh. And I was no intention of, I just made him really uh, kind of to celebrate the uh, 300th anniversary. I don't know why a robot. <laughs> I might make another one. I've got five of these. You know what they are? No. You couldn't, you know, you couldn't go out and buy a shape more perfect. So, so, yes, for, now yeah. the top don't go with it. That came from a Sunbeam grill. A, a very, you see, most of these, uh, uh, what am I trying to say? A Charcoal grill? grills are long, all uh, rectangular. That this didn't happen. Yeah, that top is, is actually from a, it was cast aluminum. See, and I thought it's I had other stuff on there. Oh, you mean you mean the top, the top part, it, not the big part. No, 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 no. The two there, pieces that. are exactly the same. Right. See, and my God, if you went out and had something made, which you'd have to do generally. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, these were two seven watt seven one hundred watt reflectors, are the reflector for seven one hundred watt bulbs. Votech up in Newcastle. I get all their junk, see. Mm -hmm. And when I seen them, I thought, oh, hell, man, there's a perfect flying saucer. Yeah. Well, I have five more of them. Five more. That's huh. five foot diameter, too. It's not small, you know what I mean? Not really. Oh, yeah. Uh, and that would be 15 feet around. UFO man goes with the flying saucer. Now, he was down at the museum. He's the only one that's not part of the family, but he was down there at the museum. Yeah, I remember. And uh, he, he was the last one I made as far as anything large. See, I, I don't have Neptune, which I probably would not make, because uh, he could tie into the family. Wait, wait, you could have he could be an uncle. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, Mercury, Mercury would be a good. Oh, I can I can think of some real good slick, sleek looking ones to make. Yeah, I could make a Mercury of you yeah. know and, and tie him in. But they would be probably uncles if you're going to use them, just because there wouldn't be nobody. No, I don't think it'll be any other how you say any of Mars or Saturn have any um, kids or anything. The, the key is not spending any money to do it. Sure. God almighty, like Disney has one down, it rolls around and probably around fifteen to twenty thousand dollars. Now the Disney uh, world, or land, no world, world, yeah. Uh, most people are amazed that they don't do more than they do. You know, they don't do more movement. They think they do more stuff to uh -huh. them. But, uh, see, if you don't have a lot of movement, then you, you come up with decorations on it that light up and you catch, you know, catch attention that sure. way. There's no room at all. You see how small my house is? Yeah. <laughs> you can't get anything in there. <laughs> a color picture and story. Now, we're talking, except for two outside columns, the whole length of the page. Far, you know, I had never had that slightest intention of making any more than really one robot. Yeah. When I did it. <laughs>